from him. So this is going to be interesting. Um, I'm actually, I know Sedgehog's a fellow commentator, but I don't really get to see a lot of his gameplay. Yeah. Um, how do you think Sedge will do? He's a character. He's definitely a player who understands how his commentary can translate into the game. Yeah. For sure. So he knows what he should be looking for. He was actually PR'd in San Diego, number seven. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. As a, he was one of the best Falcon mains in San Diego for a little while. And probably one of the best Falcon mains in SoCal for Wait, he uses minute. Falcon? He, not well. anymore. He is actually equal. Okay. But you never know. He might be coming back to the character with all the buffs the character just received. <laughs> so oh, he yeah. may be making Thanks. a play for Falcon sometime soon. Well, that'd be cool to see, especially if we got like a Falcon Ditto. Those Falcon Dittos are always hype. Always a good time. Um, but yeah, let's see who they end up going. Probably having some technical <laughs> difficulties. Yeah, uh, Sedge does use a Pro Controller. Uh, I love the Pro so Controller for the Switch. It's a very comfortable controller. I think it's a really great controller. And not only that, it's just really good transition. The reason why he uses it is he used to play ARMS. Mm -hmm. He was actually one of the top oh, commentators cool. in ARMS as well. He used to playing so many games on Pro Controller. So it's just easy to just keep one controller scheme that you're so used to go at this point. Yeah, I miss ARMS a lot. That was actually Twintel. I remember all of those characters. Yeah. It was a super fun time. That I'm surprised we never got like a, a, an ARMS representative in this game too. I know. I, I'm Honestly, I'm a little shocked. But... Hopefully we'll get to see who's... I'm, I'm just really hoping that Dragon Quest character, Erdrick, comes out. I'm ready. I'm ready for it. Dragon Quest, Quest is so hype. Yeah, and we'll find out in only a few I days. Know. Three weeks just so literally close. begins tomorrow. But actually, we're seeing um, Leaf FC bringing out Ken, which I did, he did mention that earlier when I was talking to him. He's a Captain Falcon main, but he also has recently picked up Ken. Uh, Ken got a lot of great... Um, buffs in this new patch. Him and yeah. Ryu both touched a lot. And they became real characters. <laughs> yeah, no, they did for real. And honestly, um, he was telling me there's like a proper way to like SDI, SDI out of uh, Ryu's uh, up shore you can. Mm -hmm. And it was, he was saying you can get out of it from like on like the third, like because it has like three hits or yeah. something. And I didn't even know that because it could kill really early and I guess he was just saying, yeah, a lot of people don't know that you can, but you SDI like out, down and left. But, uh, yeah, down and away. Yeah. Down away is the proper SDI. And then with Ooh. Ken, you want to DI away. Yeah, that's rough, though. It's super strong. You see how, like, just, like, the whole screen exploded. That hitbox and the damage is crazy. Ken's Ken's terrifying now, honestly. He was not a character before, and he got these buffs, and he's a completely different big turnaround. Yeah. But we like to see it, because Street Fighter characters are awesome. And it was sad, because I remember so many reviews in Smash 4 and everything, and it was just... I had to really Missing drop the character, yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, yeah, Tatsu, being able to use that to get um, back onto the stage. I forgot him and Ryu both have those um, moves. Something you forget when you never see Kens anymore. This is probably my first time commentating a Ken. Yeah. We also have the great game. players. Uh, Key, he was also ranked in SoCal with Ken. And of course, we have oh, Bosonex. Oh, really? Key yeah. uses him and Snake then? Um, currently not, I'm assuming. I did see Key rock out this is a the can a little bit earlier. Uh, we also have Bolson X from Vegas, also another great can main. Okay. <laughs> you could you could tell Sedge's head. He was like moved. He was like he's moving back. He's so scared. He's like he's a little shook. Yeah, <laughs> I'd be like, shook. What? I, yeah, I'd be shook too, man. This move was about to really just ruin my day. <laughs> what is that knockback? <laughs> Whatever back run I had, I should just kiss it goodbye. <laughs> yeah, no, that's scary. Definitely gonna shield that roller, not let him ground you at that percent. Oh, great. Um, going for the opportunity has such a lasting hitbox, going for neutral air, and that's just pressing the, the A button. Now, of course, if you guys don't know, all of Cannon Ryu's buttons all move, and according to if you press and hold the button, it's a different move. Very similar to how Street Fighter has like a, a, a low move, a mid move, and a high move. You have to press and hold the button for each one. So, nice. with focus too, it's the same thing as it was. Um, before, right, you have to have like a multi hit move yeah. for it to cancel. Or he can auto cancel it, right? Yeah. So focus can be auto canceled or focus hack cancels, is what they call it. Of course, you have to have a multi hit to make sure that focus doesn't last as long as it does. Yeah, it is a great tool for mix ups. Oh, God. And the shield pressure, too, is super scary. I think um, Ken's like jab one and jab two, It there was like an oh, that was percent. Spike, and that's it. Wow, there was an eight percent buff yeah. in like the damage. So now he does like twenty damage for like his jab. Yeah. 
that's insane. I was like, how is it? That, how did they buff it 8%? And he applies, like, crazy shield pressure. He's just one of those characters that I'm not used to seeing, but I'm, like, still, like, shocked. And then it's also one of those characters kind of have to pay attention to the fact that you have to wall him out. Mm -hmm. You know, that Ken want has very little projectiles to actually challenge you. He only has one in that short, um, and that's only for the fireball. Mm -hmm. For those of you guys wondering, that's Hadouken. The re if you just press the B button, you get the slower Hadouken, but if you manually input the actual inputs from Street Fighter, you get the faster version. And even though that's oh, yeah. only his projectile, that's the only projectile he has. So if you can use your speed and kind of wall him out, you will eventually beat him. He kind of falls a little short to zoners, but once he gets in your range, he like, like you saw, he does massive damage. Well, they actually adjusted um, the speed on those as well. It, you, like you said, you could time them differently, but since the 3.1 patch, uh, it's a lot faster or it's either a lot slower yeah. for both of them. So they changed that as well, which is actually a great buff for Ken. I mean, um, going Yoshi's Island, which is surprising. A lot of people opt out on this stage. This is my like auto ban. This, this is my new auto ban. <laughs> yeah, but pretty much. <laughs> definitely my auto ban as well. It's just like, one of those stages is just very awkward. And this all the stage kind of tilting. It's just it, To me, it's, it's worse Smashville. Huh? To me, it's worse Smashville. Yeah. It's a worse Smashville for sure. But, I mean, you can go for some, like, cheeky stuff, like, on the ledge, like, like, yeah. for, like off stage. But that's what also contributes contributes to it being like super janky okay oh he wanted he wanted to be able to go for the spike oh the, yeah the focus attack that that's so good and then he was able to cancel it like right after that'll do the stock yep what wait what percent was that that's crazy that was 80. so strong i can't believe it it's like Satisfying to like see it happen though. I don't know. Satisfying <laughs> to see it happen, but not satisfying when it happens to you, right? Oh, definitely not. I don't know why. It's just like cool to watch, and it's just like wow. Like you think that they're at a higher percent than they were because they go flying. You know, there's like no way you can even di. You're just gone. Yeah. Like don't even try it unless you di di out properly beforehand. All right, getting that good jab though. Sedge is able. To get some extra damage if he's able to connect some hits after while Ken's inked. Great yeah. tool, and uh, yeah, suddenly. Oh. Suddenly, it's looking close in terms of like how Sedge was wanting it to be. He wants to have neutral, but the problem is, even though he has neutral, Leaf FC just needs one combo like that, wow. and he'll finish him off. And, and nothing but the fist bump and handshake. Sedge pops back as soon as he sees his life flash before his eyes. Sedge was actually doing um, a great job though. He was starting to adapt um, there as well and utilize the